Hey everyone, welcome to Parasite Eve, where I regret all my decisions, but I guess that's aside from the point. I came into this room, there's two burnt corpses. Let's address the obvious. None of them say anything. Now I know I referred to them being maybe a giant dog church or something along the lines, but no, nah, they're, they're corpses. They're burnt corpses. Eve straight up went carry on their asses. Oh. Don't ask me why that triggered that guy to talk, but uh, apparently this guy is semi alive. Uh, oh, yeah. I, I don't know if the paramedics are gonna. T Melissa. She's a monster. Uh, well, I mean, she has weird Jedi powers or the force or something although I haven't seen the force mutate things to such a degree so I don't know uh, Suzanne what oh no he's dead wait that was it that was a woman I mean I I guess I guess I had noticed the anatomy of burnt corpses better than I do cuz uh, I don't know Polygonal PlayStation 1 graphics can only do so much. I digress. The point is, I still have to explore all this. Uh, the. Oh! It's a clown! Well, he could be evil or he could be a jolly old soul. I don't really know. Um. Thinks he's getting mugged, but. I, yeah, I'm, a, I'm an officer, man. I mean, I guess that's pretty fair. How are you safe? Everyone's turned into charcoal and you're safe. How are you safe? Uh, incident. You have to evacuate. Uh, you have no idea what's going on. I'm surprised you didn't hear all that screaming. Um, okay, so he's, he's, he's leaving. I'm sure he'll be alright. <laughs> yeah. Uh, what do you have in the lockers? Look, I'm scavenging. If nothing else, it's all I can do. Ammo. Well, that's excellent. I mean, sometimes scavenging has its prices, but in this case, it's perfectly legit. All I gotta do is take what I can. I don't think there's anything else. I mean, uh, I guess you could check the, the desk, but I don't think there is anything there. Oh, it's it's our first random encounter. Usually there's one per screen. Also, we got two rats. They shouldn't be too difficult to deal with. That's basically their attack pattern outside trying to bite us. They do that. I, I did it, and I leveled up. Oh man, everything just went up. Fantastic. We're already off to a great start. Now, you might be curious. That clown. Uh, well, he's right here. I, I think we can check him and I will make a note about it. Yeah. He burst into flames real quick and turned into char- That man. Talk about fast acting flames. Spontaneous combustion or whatever they were saying. Uh, pr pretty random. Pretty crazy. Did I go in this room? I felt like I did. Yeah, okay. So I'm on the next set of rooms, supposedly. That one's locked, and that one's locked. So obviously, I have to go in this one. It's the only option. Aside from maybe one other door that I may have missed. Oh. That kind of startled me a little bit. That may be really sad, but it kind of startled me a little bit. Also, uh... Hey, key! Also... This happens. Did you mimic that guy's last words? That's that's pretty impressive. 
Uh, if I remember correctly, can't really do anything with that parrot. He just kind of annoyingly flaps his wings. But I can get some medicine and I can mess with the phone. Uh, yeah. Better notify the department. Uh, that basically telephones are just your form of saving. Not unlike the second game. It, it's, it's very much the same in every regard. Uh, although, I don't think you talk to anyone, whereas in the second one, you straight up would talk to characters, and that was pretty legit. Uh, but I digress. Not important. I got a key. And with this key, I can unlock every other door, and that'll be pretty legit. And I can do some more battles. I know I should cut it, but it's still pretty early on, and it's a, it's a little bit of a challenge. Whew. I missed that fireball. Now, something we don't have to deal with is elements. Mainly, there are there are two types of elements that you will run into. There's fire and lightning. And usually one is susceptible to another type of... Uh, oh, unlocked a door. One is susceptible to a certain type of element. And you'll get guns that can that can affect that, but it's all garbage because if you have a weapon that acts on one type of element, it's garbage against the other one and will do very minimal damage. I'll explain this more later on, but uh, for all intents and purposes, these rats are very much fire elemental. So there's that. Also, he bit me. With teeth like that, that can't be good. Also, man, that's a lot of ammo. I'm getting a lot of good ammo. Also, I got a pretty neat little tool that I can use for my gun, but I'm, I'm going to save that for a little bit later because it uh, turns out this odd wall crumbles and you have a secret back room, which... Uh, how does anyone get to this? I mean, sure, there's props, and that's cool, but... Uh, ooh. Looks like we have some offense that I can use, so I might as well equip that. Let's see, I got an end vest. God help me, it does not look like she's wearing that, but I'll use the protector because it's better in a lot of ways. Also, just to make sure, I don't think there's anything around here. It's just empty space blocked by a wall, but it's still just empty space. So I'm going to come back through to the other side. I know I'm just kind of brushing over everything. There's really not a whole lot else to say. It looks like there's a lot, but there's only so much. So, uh, now that we got the key, I think we can also go into the other rooms that we really couldn't explore. And that's fine if you ask me. Now, there is a second type of enemy that we haven't run into. There's two types of enemies, rats and parrots oh that's right we have parrots also if you try to hit outside your radius uh, it doesn't work so well also parrots are parrots are kind of annoying gotta be honest let's see I'm gonna target you, and I'm gonna target you, and then now I can just focus on the parrot. Parrots are kind of annoying. They will straight up try to gun for you, and they'll, uh, they'll go a little crazy, as you saw. But that's about it. Get some medicine. How am I doing, by the way? Should probably make sure. Oh, well, my my health is my health is a little lackluster. I guess I could use some medicine. Also. My inventory is looking a little, a little full. Oh man, big giant doors, they're just props. You can't do anything with them. It looks like you can, but yeah. Unlock the door. That, that's pretty cool. 
Now, there's one more room we haven't really checked in this whole underground thing, so might as well get to it while I'm at it. Yeah, okay, forewarning. That parrot right there, unlike the other one that would just say the, uh, the last words of that one corpse, this one will actually transform. He'll, he'll mutate. Uh, e Eve's, Eve's corruption has gone to it. As such, you know, he, he's polite. He's like, Merry, Merry Christmas. Goodbye. Yeah, he, he's, uh, he's evolved. He's evolved into a mutant. So, yeah, par parrots are pretty bizarre. But all that said, I mean, there, there you go. It's all good. I don't think there's anything else I can do here. I don't think there's anything with the curtains. It was just that one thing with the closet. You don't have to talk to the pair if you don't want to. I just want the extra experience. But anyways, that's about all you can do down here in the... In the whatchamacallit. Uh... What do you mean it's locked? Did I do everything that I need to do? Uh, I guess this guy is all stationary. Uh, give me a second, viewers, as I try to figure out things. Was there a room I forgot to check? It's not that one. Was it this one? No, it wasn't that one. That was the one with the clown. I, I mean, I knew I was in it. There is one room I'm missing, and now I don't know which one it is. I'm, I've become very precautious. Not this one. No, it can't be this one. Alright. I know I'm missing a room. Was it this room? <laughs> oh. Of course. This room in between... The two rooms, it was locked. Just forgot to check this room. Right, this is a very important room. Also, there's uh, ammo in the in the wardrobe. I don't know why, it just is. Uh, but the main importance of this whole entire room is going to the desk, because clearly you can see there's a camera angle. Uh, and if I can, you want to read the the diary. So, you know, November, Monday, the Christmas show was set. Uh, oh, man, the main actress has a solo concert at the theater in Central Park. Uh, apparently, this person is sick because they have to have medication. And they want... Oh. Oh, man, selling your soul to the devil. This person really wants that part. They're very desperate. Uh, the cast was now... Suzanne... Is this Eve uh, slash Melissa, the the person that was singing and floating in the last part? Uh, oh man, she has self to overdoing it, getting hot, more medication, lady. Uh, you collapsed today. I lost conscious. Oh no, you don't care. What? <laughs> Liz, I don't understand. Are are you? passed out again uh so you're just gonna take a lot of medication uh oh i guess suzanne no longer is a concern because her apartment burnt down and she died in the fire or something uh and, and you blame yourself for the incident i mean it's probably you know 
one of those indirect sort of things or maybe your powers are just developing and you wouldn't carry on her ass or something i don't know but you got the lead and you're taking more medication <laughs> uh opening uh, okay everything went smooth uh on so and you got the solo concert let me guess more medication <laughs> I, I agree with Aya. She must have a drug problem. I mean, there's no other explanation for it. Also, my inventory is full. So, there's only one solution. I have to get rid of something. Uh, I'll just use this medication. Surely, it's unrelated. But, look, I don't care. I get it. She's like, she has a medication problem. She's just straight up like, take more medication. I killed my rival indirectly because I have freaky powers that I didn't know I had. But now I do during the night of the, the opera solo, whatever. That That's cool. Um, I just need the key. I don't need to hear your story all over again, okay? I get it. You have the thing going on. I don't really care about the thing going on. I just want to move on with the part. Go into this room that I could not go into. Oh, man. I suppose I could take my time walking to you, but I don't know. If I walk to you, I'm just going to progress the part. So next time... Uh, the confrontation.